Hello, if you saw the other videos then you know that the Leap wallet at the moment is the most complete wallet and gives you the best experience on Injective. So maybe you want to import your Kepler or Metamask wallet that you already have into Leap. And this is exactly what we are going to do today. We are going to see how to easily import your current wallet that you have on Kepler or Metamask into Leap. Please make sure to subscribe to the channel and stay in the loop when there will be new videos on how to use the different T-apps on Injective and more. Okay, so as you can see, here is the Leap extension. I have a Leap wallet set up already. Okay, and um, of course we can create multiple wallets with Leap. That is not a problem at all. You can have even 10 in the same extension we already did it we already did a video on that but um, let's say you want to use our metamask wallet which is this one okay well we have to, to connect it of course to uh, to the hub to see it and really use it as an injective wallet but um, so let's say we want to get this into leap Okay, what we do is the following. We go on wallet, so we click on the, on the wallet and there is a menu that opens. And then we click on import using seed phrase. And then here we have to put the 12 words in. So in the best case scenario, we have these words ready somewhere. Um, if not, you can also simply export them or copy them from your account. On MetaMask, we do it uh, like this. So we open the extension, we click on the top right in the, on the three dotted uh, three dots. We go to settings. We go to security and privacy. And then here we can click on reveal secret recovery phrase. So when you click on it, uh, it will ask you two uh, simple questions just so that you understand that um, basically they are not MetaMask is not uh, cannot do anything if you lose your recovery phrase. Okay, so if you lose your secret recovery phrase, MetaMask can't help you. Okay, they cannot. And if anyone, even a support agent, asks for your secret recovery phrase, you are being scammed. Okay, this. Uh, those are the questions that you have to answer. And then here you put in the password of your extension. So your pin, essentially. And when, once you do that, you click on next and the 12 words appear. These 12 words, you then type in to, um, to leap. Okay, again, how, to, how do you do it? Well, you click here. You go on import using seed phrase and you type it in. The same is possible with Kepler. On Kepler to get your seed phrase, if you don't have it handy to get it, you go on um, on the on the top right on the little head, then on the uh, dotted line, and you click on view recovery phrase. You click on it, and again, same thing as on MetaMask, you have to type in your password of your extension. Uh, or your pin, whatever you like to call it. And once you do that, you confirm it and you get the 12 words. After that, it's very simple. We will do it uh, as an example. Um, I will pause the video uh, or I will pause the recording um, to be able to see my words. Uh, and afterwards, I will come to leap and, uh, and, sh and type it in basically. Okay, I already copied the seed phrase of Kepler. Now I go into Leap. And uh, by the way, this is misleading uh, since I have the Kepler wallet now. Let's connect the Kepler wallet here so we know which assets should appear soon. So uh, it will be 2.54 inch and 339 thousand Kira that we are looking for. Okay, we go to Leap. We have the um, 
the 12 words we have the seed phrase copied in our clipboard at the moment. Will it import using seed phrase? Here I'm gonna have to cut it, okay, because I'm gonna put in my words and then click on import wallet. So see you after the cut. Alright, so we type it in, it's loading and it worked as you can see 2.54 inch and 339,000 kira perfect so this is how to do it how to import your metamask or kepler wallet into leap i hope you enjoyed it and you learned something and please make sure to like or comment if you want to give some feedback